Welcome back to Let's Play Mad Max. I'm Burning Dog Face. And, uh... This isn't Mad Max. This doesn't even look a little bit like Mad Max. In fact, that's why we're here. This is Monster Hunter World, and I thought it would be nice to remind you guys that... Green living places do still exist! Look, this is a shrub. And this is a tree. And if I go just over here... Look, vast quantities of natural water. Just in case y'all had forgotten. <laughs> and with that fun over with, now we're back to the desert. Mmm. Home sweet home. These don't look green anymore. What's up with that? I've just noticed. And the sound effects have been interrupted. Odd. Yeah, put that back on my face for funsies. Let me see. I was right. That's weird. At least it doesn't charge you again to uh, put those on. Yeah, I just came across this in the middle of fucking nowhere. Well, not in the middle of nowhere. That would be here. But off to the side of nowhere. Hello? Oh, hi there! I mean, that was a really dumb thing for you to do. Ah. Oh. I wonder if that guy's gonna come back. Come on! Fine, I'll just beat the hell out of you. Actually, was a hitch. That wasn't just the uh, video messing up this time. Don't mind if I do. Oh hey, what am I going to spend all this on anyway? Don't need that yet. I just got that. No. Oh, it was pointed out to me. Uh, this really confused me, because this seems better in every way than this one, which I can't get until I do something more advanced. But uh, it was pointed out to me that you probably need the other ones to specify some of the archangels. Oh, by all means! That's actually a great idea, isn't it? Well, yes, if you're asking me. Baller. Massive V6. I feel we are on a good path. But let it be known, there is much more we can do to, for her to reach her full potential. Why does the handling get worse with this one? Oh, it greases acceleration. That's why... <laughs> Humongous V6. So this, this would be that one. Order this one is. Curiously, they spell Humongous correctly. Unlike the villain of uh, Mad Max 2, the Road Warrior, uh, the Lord Humongous, who spells it uh, a little differently. Let's go with the massive V6. Ooh. Neat. And get this up a level. Bumper hook attachment. The power of this harpoon almost makes my head spin. The wonders that can be done now that we can slam into the tail end of an enemy. Connect the rear bumper of a vehicle and perform a harpoon slam attack when hitting boost. The increased durability also enables the harpoon to pull down strong structures. Oh, yes. Hmm. I'll do almost all of it, though. 
That would be really fun, though. Looking around, that's a quest I just remembered. Uh, I need to kill dudes for this. I'm really surprised Pig and Sticka turns out to be one guy. I thought it was going to be like a... Uh, what's it called? Master Blaster situation. Should probably just get that, huh? Let me take a look at the Archangels. Why is that not working? Oh, because it's all the way over to the right, that's why. Let's see where I'm close. To. Oh, oh, that's not bad. Uh huh. Fuck. I went looking, man. I tried. Okay, serious question. Who the fuck would take the uh, the bandit name Rim Jobby? That's very close. That's going to be a while. I like that this one is rust colored, though. Oh, it's a jack, of course. It's actually not as good in almost every way as the one I've got, so I'm just going to leave it for the moment. But I am going to throw those spikes on. Whole body barbs. Spikes protruding from all points of her delicate skin will keep the infidels from touching her with their godless fingers. Makes it nearly impossible for boarders to land on any part of the magnum opus. And there's still a clear path open for, uh... Our boy Chum Bucket to climb over the engine. Which makes sense, since he's the one who installed them. Uh, a second one, huh? Oh, I like that logo for the buzzard camp. I never noticed that before. Do I want Most this? Most infidels fail to recognize the sacred parts of the great spiritual schemes scattered across the hills and valleys. I recognize their scrap as holy treasure. Now when you say infidels, does that include me? I'm just asking. Pointing. Oh, by the way, I found out, uh, kind of by accident, that, uh, originally the Ripper here was, uh, a pre-order bonus. I guess that came with the, uh, all the DLC, uh, version of this game. We stopped dead in our tracks. That doesn't normally happen. Imagine if we could build a bus. That's not good. I should put those tires on so that we can get ready to run. Oh dear. Deary, deary, dear. Keep an eye on the car. Ow. Down you go. Shoulder charge of that guy. Yeah, 
You know, it took me a while to figure out what felt like it was missing. But I did manage it eventually. Ready for you. It didn't work at all. In uh, the actual Batman Arkham games, you can press B to stun the enemy in front of you. Get him to lower his guard for a second. Damn it. Oh, just fucking die already. You know, a bus, probably a pretty easy thing to rig up into a, uh, into a home in the wasteland. I mean, these guys clearly don't give a shit, but you could just, like, cover up all the windows. Plenty of room. I mean, you know, you'd either have to sit, sleep, sleep sitting up or uh, drag a mattress in there. But, I mean, it's the wasteland, so sleep, learning to sleep sitting up is probably a good idea anyway. You don't want to be a deep sleeper in the end of the world. It's really impressive that the paint doesn't run when he does this. Point to that at all. Okay, um. Yeah, there's a second one here somewhere. I wonder if the buzzards have their own equivalent of a top dog. Oh, there it is. Yoink! I follow the road, to be honest. Oh, well, yeah, no, that's not going to happen yet. The highest I've ever gone is three skulls. That took a lot out of me. Plus, I wasn't a top dog mission. There was no boss there. Water. Actually, I know it's dramatic, but you don't need to do that every time. Oh, that's right, I never did find where the fucking water thing was here. Oh, yeah, no big fan of uh, collection or anything. Is it you? Is there just a pan somewhere? Fuck if I know. Oh, for fuck's sake, man. Step over the chain. Is it over there? Rolling to move faster suddenly brings me flashbacks to, uh... Ocarina of Time. My brothers insisted on rolling every possible chance they got because they 
We're certain it made them move faster. You know what? They're probably right. It still felt ridiculous. Why, why do we stay, Saint? I'm begging for trouble here. You are correct. Let's get out of here. Stupid water logo. Oh, okay. I'll just kill you then. I'll keep an eye. Let's call that survival of the fittest. Oh. Okay. It keeps happening. I'm gonna call it Wasteland Madness. Chum, I ask you this as your friend. What the fuck are you talking about? Man, that's that. We're keeping going. Whoa! So the wind effect there, that was neat. I thought the war rigs were, uh, the great big trucks they used in Fury Road. So I don't know why they would say that just there. tunnel. This old highway tunnel leads all the way through the northern mountain ridge. For a long time, it was used by Gastown to send the great rigs on their trading runs to the citadel until the buzzards reached the tunnel. They blocked it off and ambushed the last war rig to pass through, setting up a lair from which to do nightly raids on, on the dead barons. Hope has revealed that she fled from a war rig that was ambushed by buzzards while passing through a tunnel. Search the northern tunnel for valuables. Maximum mag sniper rifle upgrade. Neat. The headlights are on, you'll notice. We just can't see shit. Should be to the right. Uh, this was blocked off recently. In the ambush. It's so gummy in here. What are they called? Mudder tires? I don't have those. You know, my incredible powers of observation tell me that the buzzards have been here. I wonder if I could, like, Mortal Kombat a guy up against those spikes. Oh, right. It didn't really help me look down, but ah, oh, jeez. Don't fall. There we go. I'm getting a weird flashback to some of the areas from uh, The Evil Within. It's just covered in, you know, less gore. You noted. Try not to think about the fact that their bellies are full of human flesh. I 
Hello. Creepy. Oh, hell. I saw a loading screen tip, which specifically noted that if you, uh... Parry when no attack is incoming, it breaks your chain. Dude! Who does that? I'm not gonna lie, that car looks bitchin'. Shit, there's a timer. What in the hell is that? It's a night buckler. Let them come. We wait in the dark. The echo heard clanging deep in the dark is an attacker trying to break through a night buckler's shield. The scream of the defeated is their victim, knocked down and gutted with their cogwheel axe. He's evade to dodge their charge attack and strike them from behind. For frontal assaults, avoid bare-fisted attacks. Melee weapons and knuckle dusters can break through their shields much faster. The shiv is ineffective while a night buckler still holds his shield. <laughs> I think another one of the wizard's things mentioned the night bucklers, but I've never actually encountered one before. High-value vehicle. Don't know how the fuck I'm gonna get it out of here, but... Oh, it's fast! Even in this crap, it's fast. Is that? Yes, it is. But I should call it, so I'm gonna grab this scrap and then do just that. I'm Burning Dog Face. And I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Mad Max. We gotta keep looking for that war rig. And we gotta find a way to get this delicious car out of this tunnel. But, uh... That can wait. I'm... So to say, there's a bit glitching out there. Later!